He's going to start it. He's going to start it. For us. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look how heavy it is. Stand back. This machine is one big cylinder. And when we say this is the biggest steam machine, we mean the biggest cylinder in the world. And that is the cylinder <laughs> as it came out of the factory. Oh, wow. And in that cylinder, one big piston. That big block is mounted with these five columns on the piston. So, when the so is it going to pump for that? Is yeah. That? <laughs> and then it goes up and down. The arms make this, this movement and we begin to pump. And nowadays we don't pump with, uh, with eight pumps, but we do it with two pumps. Pump number two, yep. and at the, at, the, at the other end, pump number six, to be a little bit in balance. Uh, when we decided to make the lake empty with steam, we didn't have experience with steam. So we asked English engineers to design this machine for us. Yeah? Yeah. After that, it was made in England, shipped to the Netherlands, and assembled here. So this is 100% English. Oh. And the English engineer didn't start from, uh, from zero, but they used the whole concept that was already in use in the tin mines of Cornwall, in the Cornwall. south. Yeah. Yeah. There you have to pump so water really from, the, uh, from the mines to the, uh, yeah. to the surface. Yeah. That is not too much water, but over a few hundred meters, and we wanted a lot of water over yeah. just five meters. But the whole concept is the same as in the tin mines. Yeah. So that's the reason why we always had an English engineer here. He had his, uh, his experience with these machines from the tin mines. Yeah. And when he works, uh, I can make it move, and then he moves with three strokes per minute. And in the good old days, he did six strokes per minute. So what you will see is half the speed that it used to be. The design speed of this machine is eight strokes per minute, and in the beginning he did his eight strokes per minute, but uh, then the whole building was shaking and trembling. <laughs> so they, it was not a good idea for the long term, so they minimized it till six strokes per minute, and that's, that's what he always did. Okay. Was this whole building just made for this? Yes. Hmm? The whole building was made for this? Yes, but you can imagine oh, the, 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 the circle form is because of the arms uh, yes. coming out yes. of this. So this is. And, and the, 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 the machine and the building are uh, built at the same time. Mm. So this is not put into this building, but the, the building, building is around it. Yeah. Yeah. It's huge. It, a lot, it looks like there's a lot of pressure on those hinges, because that's like where the whole arm is being pivoted against. You can see everything going on. Pure mechanic. This is the first time that I start the machine. Today, it's a little bit cold, so it takes some time. Is it moving really slow? <laughs> no, when it moves, it moves a constant, constant speed. It's always the same. But we don't work with steam, but complex oil. The oil is cold, yeah. it some time. Heavy. When you walk through this building, uh, the whole building is uh, neo-gothic and this is built in the beginning of the industrial age and at that time they didn't have an architecture for things like this, this is just a factory. Mm. But this is built uh, in the way they built everything. Mm town hall or a big house, that's all the same style. And later on in the industrial age, <coughs> they had an uh, architecture for uh, industrial objects, but this is built. So it's too, in our vision, too much ornamented. Ornate, yeah. But um, yes. <laughs>
Each pump brings up 8 cubic meters of water, so 8 metric tons yeah. of water. And we do it with 8 pumps at the same time, so we bring up 64 tons of water in one stroke. So that must be the most yeah. power in this machine. So, what are the other ones that are like, how, how are they not attached? How are they, how are they stop the other ones that pump? Because they're still attached by the... Ah, but... In that pump we have a lot of falls, the falls are gone. And just move. Well this this pump works 